called Leap71. We are a software company from Dubai and we build computational engineering models. It's a new approach to how we design things. And um, we do various things, heat exchangers, electric motors, rocket engines. An enterprising couple from Germany is designing rocket engines in the UAE. Interestingly, they don't have an office, but work from home or cafes in Dubai. For Josephine Listener and Lynn Kayser, co-founders of the Dubai-based company Leap71 in the UAE, all they had to do was work hard and innovate. And that's exactly what they did. And because we're a software company, very often people ask us, are these things functional that you design? They look so fancy and so complicated, but will they work? So um, that actually drove us this year to say, okay, why don't we just test fire a rocket engine as a small software company? I mean, it's not what you usually do, but we could prove that our computational models are functional. So within a very short time frame of like two months, we partnered with University of Sheffield uh, in the UK and we did a completely autonomous engine design. They helped us to uh, post-process it and get it to the test stand in the UK and we ended up test firing the first liquid rocket engine in the UAE or from the UAE. So the main purpose of going through all of this was to demonstrate that we can generate functional rocket engines in this case because we don't design them how engineers typically design them. So engineers usually sit down in front of their computer screen and they manually draw every little detail on that thing. And that's a very lengthy process. And what we are doing is a method called computational engineering, where I write computer code, and then I basically press the button and the computer automatically generates the geometry. So I teach the AI what rules to apply, but then it acts uh, autonomously. Kayser, one of the co-founders of Leap71, delved into the establishment of their company and why they chose to start it in the UAE. We noticed after a while that we're always coming back here. You know, we, we, we were traveling a lot uh, over the past years, and we always noticed that uh, we stay longer every time we come here. And so when we had to decide where to start our new company, we looked at many places. Um, we looked at Singapore, we looked at Europe, we looked at the United States, etc. But it became very clear to us very quickly that you know, this is the right place to do it. And it has to do with a lot of factors. I mean, first of all, it's a great place to live. Now, honestly, it's, it's probably the one place um, that uh, I would personally choose and we would choose for personal reasons, even if you forget about the whole business side of things. But it is a very pleasant place to live. It's safe, uh, people are very nice. Uh, it's probably one of the most cosmopolitan places I've ever experienced. You know, I have 200 different nationalities all living you know, without any trouble together. And so it's a bit of an oasis in, in this world. So you know, this was a strong motivation for us. They worked on several projects with Dubai's Future Labs, as well as with the Technology Innovation Institute in Abu Dhabi. And they are expecting more projects worldwide in the near future.